girl. Let's go potty. Oh, man. Good girl. Oh, did you get it? Did you get it? Good girl. So, part of what I want to see behaviors coming from Bailey. Oh, sorry, Bailey. Is when we come out to this place that she recognizes, hey, we're going to go potty first. We're going to take care of those basic needs. So, I know you're going to feel better when we have to deal with stress. What's soon going to happen after she gets rid of those those basic needs, those basic needs are met, she's more apt to learn. She's more apt to be more positive about her environment. Have you ever gone to the bathroom? Really had to go to the bathroom and try to get information? Your boss stops you or your kids start complaining, I need this, 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 and this, and all you can focus on going to the bathroom. Same thing. She goes to the bathroom. She's already anticipating relieving herself. Why try and bother her with stress? After she goes to the bathroom, she's more receptive. She feels better. She can do play behaviors. And I'm not talking about play, free play with the emotional system. I'm talking about just feeling better. Just like when you go, your brain's actually lit it, lighting up as well. So you're in a better state of mind. Just like when you go to the bathroom, your boss or your kids start complaining or asking for stuff. You're more able to match their needs and listen to their needs because your needs got met. Empathy, compassion, kindness. So Bailey's now actually able to realize safely, we're going to go to the bathroom. This is priority. These needs will be taken care of. This is all building trust and connection. So when we do have stressors, they're not going to matter as much. This is Scott with Second and No One Canine Life Coaching. Helping take care of your dog's basic needs. So their emotional needs will be a lot easier to handle.